Hello, everybody. Welcome to another day of social studies on Monday. Hope you all had a good weekend. And today, what we're going to be focusing on is seeing how with reconstruction, when the country is being rebuilt or reconstructed after the Civil War, there's different perspectives or ideas about how the country should be rebuilt and what the goals or kind of like end thing people are working towards with rebuilding the country. And we're going to see that this first perspective we're going to look at is called presidential reconstruction, where a new president, Andrew Johnson, who takes over after Abraham Lincoln, is going to have his first try at reconstructing and rebuilding the country and seeing what the impacts or effects of that plan was. And of course, this really shows first what happened and the impacts on freed people and the kind of just country as a whole after the Civil War. And that's going to set us up for what we're going to learn later and see how these two plans are different from each other. And this connects to the world today because even, of course, as you can see, when people are kind of seeing like major problems or things that people need to heal from, either if it's like a political division like the Capitol riots or coronavirus, kind of how do we come out of these major um, problems and there's different perspectives, different goals for like, well, this is what we should be fighting towards to make sure this never happens again. Or should we just kind of get back to how things were before and just kind of pretend like nothing ever happened. So that's the same thing that people are dealing with after the Civil War. How do we move forward? What lessons do we learn? And what's kind of the goal of rebuilding the country after a major tragedy? So I hope you enjoy the lesson. Make sure you're watching all the videos and have a great day on your Monday.